This is a quick guide to downloading the library resources that you'll need to access offline for your proctored exams. We're going to look at downloading one of the College of Law publishing manuals as an ebook, as well as documents from the legal databases. So in this example, we're going to be looking for the Property Law and Practice Manual. So first of all, find a link in your module reading list, or you might need to do a search in library search on the online library page in StudyNet. So I'd advise using this search to find all the different manuals. Law with College of Law as the publisher name in uh, quotes and the year to make sure you're finding the most recent. So this ebook is available from ProQuest eBook Library, and this eBook platform has two different options for downloading the eBook. We're going to look at the most suitable one here for you, as um, having access to it for your exams. Is the option here is to download each chapter as a PDF document. Now the PDFs do not expire. They will have hyperlinks within the same document or chapter and you can use the search copy and paste. So you can choose which um, chapters you want to download from the home page of the ebook within the table of contents. Now although there is a limit here as to how much you can download, um, also shown on the home page, this is reset every 24 hours. So in one 24 hour period, you can download up to 40% of the ebook. So this slide shows the different steps involved in downloading. So first choose the chapter or chapters from the tables of contents on that home page. You may be prompted to check out the ebook. So you can just choose the one day loan option and then it'll tell you that your document is ready to download and you just click download and your file it will be saved in your downloads folder. And then the download limit on the home page will be updated showing you how many more pages you can um, is available to download in that 24 hour period. So do make sure you allow enough time to download all the book all the chapters or the entire ebook, um, you'll need a total of 72 hours to download the entire ebook. Downloading the documents that you'll need to refer to during your exams is very easy um, from the legal databases. So each of them have options to email or download specific documents once you find the document in the database. And you can choose to email them or download them as PDF or Word documents. If you need to download any acts of legislation from Westlaw, then you can choose to download specific sections if those are needed. And again, via email or download options. But for the legislation option, you can also view the entire act as a PDF and that then can be downloaded onto your desktop or laptop. So it's easy to download documents from Lexis Library as well. In this example, I've selected to download documents from the Encyclopedia and Forms and Precedents. But on, on any page in Lexis Library, you can choose to download or email from these icons shown here and you're prompted as to the format you want to download. Uh, I'd recommend Word or PDF and in choosing the email options it's going to send the document as an attachment by default. So it is very easy to download. Um, as I've shown you with the different options, but if you do need more help, then please use the help within the individual databases. And there's a link here to more help on StudyNet for downloading the ebook from ProQuest.